Hello everybody, welcome back to another quick Premiere Pro tutorial. Today I'm gonna to teach you how to make a thick white border around your videos, just like you see in all those Apple commercials. The border really makes everything look crisp and clean and helps focus people's attention right in on your video. If that's what you're looking to do, stick around because we're gonna do that right now. So here we are at the computer. Welcome to the jungle. We got fun and games. All, all the plants are real, no fake plants here. Check this out, this is a Bella Palm. It's pushing out a new leaf. That's so exciting, each leaf is bigger than the next. If you're a plant person, you're, you're like, you wait months for something to happen and something happens, you're like, oh yeah, that's so cool. So yeah, if you're into plants, there you go. Uh, and if you're not, let's get to the tutorial. So I'm gonna teach you how to make a thick white mat around your videos. It's a very classic, clean look and it's super easy to do. All right, and if you're into this kind of stuff, Subscribe to the channel. I got a lot more tutorials coming up on video editing, photography, photo editing, and all that kind of stuff. So hit the subscribe button, give it a thumbs up. Let's get into it. All right, so this is the video clip we're gonna use. This is a nice moody sunset. We had a nice hazy sky, nice warm tones, nice compression with a 105 millimeter lens. Looks pretty good. So now I'm gonna teach you how to do a mat, a white color mat. So in this tutorial, I'm gonna teach you how to make a mat. I'm gonna teach you how to scale your image, create an adjustment layer and crop. We're gonna do all four of those things here. Okay, so first things first, a white color mat, super easy. You take your, uh, you take your video clip, you move it up to the second track. And then right down here, you see this little icon, new item. And we are going to find, what are we looking for, color mat. Okay, and what we want is a white color mat, and you can call it whatever you want, blah, 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 blah. Okay, and we're gonna take it, we're gonna pop it in underneath our video file. All right, so now we can't see the color mat because the video clip and the color mat are the same size. So we have to shrink the size of the clip. So over here on the right in your effects controls, you can see there's a scale button. You can uh, punch in the scale manually or you can uh, drag this little bar across, or drag this little node across the bar. And uh, let's go for 70%. So now, this is the quick and easy way to make a color mat. Dun da da da! But now, wait, there's more. All right, so now let's say you want to adjust your video. You want to change the colors around, maybe you want to mute the colors, oversaturate the colors, whatever you want to do. Let's say you want to adjust the video. So we right click here, add track, there we go, now we've added a new track. And now what you wanna do is go back to this little icon here and make an adjustment layer. And you can call that adjustment layer whatever you like to. So we're gonna pop that adjustment layer over top of everything. Now what you can do here in your effects controls, type in Lumetri. Scroll down to the bottom so all those presets there, but we're gonna just gonna go with the, uh, the Lumetri and drag it right on top of the adjustments layer and just drop it. So now you can see here in your effects controls, you have Lumetri color. And we're gonna go to basic correction. And let's say we want to, I don't know, let's change the color temperature. Should we make it more orange? There we go, now it's more orange. And the exposure, mm, okay, you know what? Let's bring up the contrast. Let's really silhouette it. There we go. So now it's like super contrasty, super silhouetted. Uh, you know what, I actually like it less contrasty. There we go, less contrasty. Um, highlights, let's bring the highlights down a little bit. Shadows, we're gonna bring them up. Uh, whites, blacks, blacks, let's see. Yeah, blacks, we're gonna bring down a touch. Okay, so now we have made an adjustment layer and adjusted our, our footage to look a certain way. But, do you notice the problem here? Can you see the white mat isn't white anymore? We've sort of adjusted this, made this adjustment layer cover everything. So now the color mat is no longer white. Now, if you want a nice off-white color mat, there you go, you're done. But let me show you how to fix this issue. And you guessed it, it's super simple. Just go back to the scale here and we're gonna scale it down to 70%. And bingo. So now our adjustment layer is only affecting the video. So let's take a look. 
What have we created here? There we go. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Nice moody sunset, nice orange sky. It looks really nice. Kind of reminds me of uh, the Bad Boys movie. You know that scene in Miami where the plane flies over the billboard and everything's got this nice orange glow. Okay, so this technique works great if your video is 16 by nine and your workspace is 16 by nine and your adjustment layer is 16 by nine. But what if your video is in a regular shape? If you reduced everything by 70%, it's not gonna fit, it's not gonna line up properly. So let's look into that situation because that's also an easy solution. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is let's adjust the video and type crop in here. So we got the crop and we're just gonna drag and drop that on top of our video. And let's make this like a super narrow, ultra wide aspect ratio. So we're gonna bring the top down and we're gonna bring the bottom up. There we go, now we got a super wide aspect ratio and as you can see, our adjustment layer doesn't fit. Ah, don't worry, here's the solution, super easy. We're gonna click here on the adjustment layer and then here where it says opacity, we're gonna open that menu and you can see there's an oval, there's a square and there's a pen tool. Click on the square and boom, it opens up a mask. So what you wanna do is line up the mask to the corners and you can adjust the feather of the mask. You can make it really blurry or I mean soft or hard edge, whatever you want to do. And here's a trick. You can pop in here, see it's everything set to fit, but if we scale to 100%, we can get a little closer. And if you want, you can even scale all the way up to 400%. So you can get super accurate. Now this, this technique is obviously going to take a little bit longer, but uh, you can definitely do it. You can line everything up nicely. There we go, there we go, and other side. There might even be a faster way to do this than, uh, than I know. If you do know a faster way of doing this, let me know in the comments down below, but this is the way I do it. So here we go. We have everything lined up. And that is that. Super simple, super easy. Now, let me show you what this looks like all rendered. All right, that is that. We are now done. This tutorial is over. Thank you for watching. Now you know how to make a thick white border around your videos. If you like this kind of stuff, please subscribe to the channel. Would really appreciate it. I got a lot more tutorials rolling out in Premiere Pro, Photoshop, uh, Lightroom, and I'm gonna be doing some tutorials on photography as well. So if you're into learning new things, subscribe to the channel because I got some stuff for you. All right, peace out. I will see you guys in the next one.